that because when you go to a church and you are in the political arena, people just assume that you're going to be there and the primary purpose is you know, to campaign. And so, uh, you know, we, yeah, we brought all our signs to pass out, but the ushers wouldn't let us. So, you know. <laughs> no, seriously, when I first ran for office, I mean, I'd been a pastor and I'd been the president of the Baptist Convention, and a lot of people in the state knew me of, of, because of the, being president of the convention. And um, so when I first ran, there was still a lot of heartburn about a person like me running for office. And I remember one of the early experiences I had of a lady coming up to me and said, now, let me see if I get this right. You're an ordained minister. I said, yes, ma'am, that's correct. Right. And she said, a Baptist. I said, yes, ma'am. <laughs> well, are you one of those narrow-minded Baptists who think only Baptists are going to heaven? <laughs> I says, no, ma'am. Actually, I'm more narrow than that because I don't think all the Baptists are going to make it. <laughs>